Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 4. When we last left off, well, uh, it didn't exactly go to plan. Uh, we took a crazy ride on this uh, cart here, which was, you know, interesting. It was fun. Um, sadly, it ended in disaster thanks to the good old uh, power of QTEs. Now, um, <laughs> what I didn't realise... Oh, look at that. Look at that motion blur. Oh, all that film grain. I'm, I'm gonna be sick. Anyway, um, yeah, so I didn't realize that the checkpoint didn't start us here. So when I started recording this video, we had to go all the way back through the uh, crumbly uh, underground desert area, um, as I like to call it. But uh, that wasn't too bad. Uh, we didn't get the best roll of luck. It wasn't as good as our luck last time. Uh, only got a handful of bullets. Uh, basically ran out of everything but from uh, a couple of those parasites back there we did get a few lucky drops so we're, we're, we're reasonable we're reasonable anyway let's continue shall we okay okay you ready Leon you ready yeah me neither but uh Sooner we get this done, the better, eh, buddy? Ugh. Ah, God damn it. Let's go. Alright. Yeah, that's probably not the best thing to do, to be honest. Let's just mine these guys. We're just going to farm these guys as much as we can. Ow. Cheers, pal. Ow. Thank you. In fact, let's go for the shotgun. Also, I need to turn my headset out. Because it's fucking deafening, son. Deafening. Alright, come on, you big bold fuck. Come on. Come on. Damn it, gotta keep looking behind me. It's probably not the best place to be in this entire thing. But, you know. We like to live dangerously or something. Can you not make a double herb? With... Uh, I can't remember. Okay. It is what it is. Ooh. Nice. Also nice. Get the fuck out of here, bitch. Right. Ow. You're dead. You. Ow. Thanks for the next stab. Come on. Need to finish as many of these guys off. Oh, no. Not sure if we got lucky here or not. Uh, I'm going to say no because we're just getting interrupted by all of these cutscenes and basically everything that's going on. That's empty. Uh, okay, let's try and run over. Right, let's burn you fuckers. Burn you fuckers. Uh, you are not going to be burning me. You're dead. Okay. Okay. Now, this is actually pretty disastrous. Let's use some fire. We're going to really need to get the fire out here. You, if you could, stop throwing stuff at me. I would really appreciate it. Oh, boy. This could be bad, guys. Uh, yep, this is bad. We're dead. Oh, God. That was savage. Should we try that again? Oh, this bit's going to be rough, just because we've got so many enemies coming at us. And we don't have any weapons that do any damage. Ooh, and we're really not going to use the Magnum. Definitely not going to be using the Magnum. Right, let's try that. What we want to try and do, maybe, is stay at the back. Yeah, we're going to stay at the back. So we can see everything, and then everything has to come towards us, then. Well, I say that. Sometimes they just spawn in here. I want to try and fight everything, because I want the loot drops. But then I guess you have to balance it out, don't you? Do you want the loot drops? Ah, oh, fuck's sake. You can fuck off. 
Yeah, let's get creative in this thing, huh? Right. Okay. Right, you're dead. Really don't want to be wasting that. But let's reload it whilst we have 30 seconds. Oh, wait. We don't have 30 seconds. I lied. Right, give me the... Give me... Why can't I... Yeah, the prompt to jump over is very unreliable, apparently. Yeah, when you're trying to transition to the next uh, car, it's very... Thanks, bud. It's very inconsistent. Uh, let's eat that. Okay, what's in the handgun? Let's go for the handgun. Get ready to... Dug. Okay, that... That didn't really work in the manner that I wanted it to work in. Right, okay. Now. This is the shotgun's... Time to shine. Really want to stab this guy, because he just eats our ammo. Right, there we go. The more people we can stab here, the better, to be honest. There we go. Keep working that leg, Leon. Keep working that leg. Yeah. Alright, not bad. Unfortunately, ooh, ah, close. We are slowly winding them down. Oh, Perfect. That couldn't have gone better. I mean, you know, what's the opposite of it? Couldn't have gone better? Ah, it could have gone better. Right, yeah, that one. Ow. Well, that grenade just disappeared into nothing, didn't it? Okay. Gonna have to use our grenades here because those things will kill us on the next hit. Oh, apparently it doesn't always kill. That that did the trick. Right, whilst we've got 30 seconds, reload. Uh, and that. Ah, okay. Relax. Now, what do we have? Now, this is the next fu factor coming up here. We need to try and survive. Right, is everything loaded? I mean, kind of, I guess. We've come out of that with a lot of bullets, which is nice. You know, bullets are good. We like these things. Uh, what we are not exactly thrilled about is the lack of health. Uh, I mean, I guess, I guess we could just eat that herb that we have got. However, it's not really going to dig us out of the situation, is it? Oh, you dickhead. Right. Now, depending on the QTE gods, we will either survive this or we won't. There doesn't appear to be any in between. Doesn't seem to matter how much you mash X here. I need to have my hands next to at least six different types of buttons. Because keyboard, yo. Right, let's go back. There we are. And you know what? No time. No time to be playing with these guys. Apparently. Oh, hey, friend. I think he was trying to be friendly. I think he was. A little bit hard to tell. Can we not throw axes at me? Can we? Can we really not throw axes at me? Oh, chainsaw again. I forgot about you. Right. Now, let's knife you. Because, to be honest, I can't be dealing. Oh, no, Leon, what are you doing? Leon, why? 
Right, okay, reload. Reload. There's a herb. You want the herb? You're dead. You're dead. Oh, great. And we're stuck. In a cart. With... Yeah, there was no way we could even aim that because of the hitbox. We were literally shooting right at it, but because of the hitbox of the wibbly-wobbly train cars, the bullets were just going through the floor, even though we were aiming right at it. Oh, this game really hasn't held up. Okay. Right, so we got a little bit better on the RNG there with some shotgun shells. Oh. Right, what have we got? Let's try this yet once again. We'll have that. You know, I've been playing quite a lot of Bloodborne recently. I've decided to get into... Um, I, I decided because, you know, Eld, uh, Elden Ring just came out, I thought I'd give it a go. But I thought, no, I'm going to play one of the older games before I decide to dump stupid money into uh, a game that I might not like. So I thought I'd give Bloodborne a go. I'm actually really enjoying it. And it has a better difficulty than this. Much better difficulty than this. It's way less frustrating. This is just bullshit. Right, well, yeah, and sometimes they hit you with those things, sometimes they miss. Ugh. Now, I said when I started recording, I'm not going to let this game annoy me, it's not going to irritate me, I'm just going to go with the flow. But already, this game is irritating the absolute piss out of me. Right, cool. Now let's get back. Gotta get those goodies. Gotta get those goodies. It's definitely more fun when these prompts work. Come on. Shotgun reload. Thank you. Great. Thanks for the... Oh, good. It's doing that thing where the gun doesn't work properly. Can we dodge, please? Thank you. Uh, I mean, I guess we got a free full heal, so there's that. We'll hold on to that for now. Oh, okay. Groundhog Day. He's going to pop. Is he going to pop? He's not going to pop, apparently. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's just live with the shotgun for a bit, shall we? Oh god, we've hit the thing when we didn't want to hit the thing, so we've missed all of the ammo because... Because of course we have. Can I get into my inventory, please? Can't use the inventory when uh, Leon is going through any kind of animation. Uh, now, is a grenade actually going to... Yeah, grenades don't really work very well here either. And we're about to get hit. Can I turn around? Quick turn. Can I can I jump over here? The, this part of the game wasn't very well made at all, was it? You know, it was never really designed with Leon being on a movable object because it throws off all the hit detection. Like, everything just feels off. I think is the best way to say. Okay. Right now, let's wait for him to start his chainsaw up. Luckily, those guys aren't actually as strong as they used to be, which is nice. Right, what have we got? Standard dudes, we can handle the standard dudes. Right, here we go. This is where things go crazy. This is where we need to get ready for QTEs. Come on, QTEs. Notice how the enemies are completely unaffected by this as well.
Right, what QT are we gonna get? We're we gonna get X again. Right, I was gonna say, I could literally not mash that button any faster. <sighs> well, I'll tell you what. Going through this weapon challenge illustrates just how awfully designed that bit was. Okay. Now, we have some semblance of normality back. Yeah, that's awful, man. Oof. Not great at all. Anywho. Glad we got through it. Oh, is there any... Uh, that's not what I wanted. No, there's nothing here. Okay, cool. Right. Oh. Yes, I remember this bit. Still, that is probably one of the harder parts of the game that is done. And it's, like I say, it's, it's hard. Not because it's fair, it's hard because it's bullshit. Right, Stone of Sacrifice. Uh, is there really nothing in this room? Makes me think there's probably something in this room. Uh, what we got in the bag? We ain't got a lot in the bag, have we, old Leon? Old buddy, old pal. I mean, it's not bad. Like, we have 11 cartridges. We've got a good amount. For the handgun as well, 35. We've got some nades, so, you know, we, we've got some tactical options. And we still have the uh, RPG as well. I still have not decided where I'm going to use that. Okay. Let's keep... Con Actually, do I want to save it? Uh, there's no point, really. Not really, there's no point. I think we get a proper checkpoint here anyway, so... Yeah, we do, because this is on to the next part. It's locked. Offer the sacrifice to the lion. Do it. Uh, yeah, this is a transition. Uh, which means... Actually, let's go back and see the merchant. Because we might be able to buy... Um, uh, yeah, we could probably buy a first aid spray off him. If he's got one. I can't remember how the uh, first aid spray works. Whether it's down to where you are. Um, like how many, you know, he actually has in a certain area. Or whether you can buy one if you don't have one. I can't really remember how it works. I'm pretty sure each new area you get to, he only has X amount. Welcome. Which is fine. Got some rare things on sale. What yes, you, you do. I've got some things for you. Uh, oh, God, honestly, mate, I, I, you could have that for free and my handgun. Um, Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Is that all? <laughs> so that stuff of royalty. You. Don't think we can do anything with that. Don't think we do anything Come with that. Anytime. Pretty sure. Um, seems to have substantial value, yeah. Uh, it's only, you know, what are you one of their family uh, heirlooms anyway, so. Ah. Might as well <laughs> get you. something out of it. And all this rifle ammo as well, yeah. Mm. Ah, nah, we'll hold on to that. What right. Now. Right, so he's got two available in stock. Is that all? You know what? I'm gonna buy them. And no, I'm not ashamed. Is that all? I didn't actually realise. I don't. I can't remember if I've ever had to buy first aid sprays off him before. I probably have at some point. Um, you know, but I didn't realise. He had so many. I literally thought it was just like one per area or something, but yeah, I guess not. Okay, on to the next chapter. 
at least I'm fairly certain this is a new, it, this is a new chapter, isn't it? Because that's the whole point of this area. We go back to being inside, I think. I'm trying to remember where you actually fight Salazar. Yeah, that's it. And we will save it. Just because. <clears throat> okay. 41 saves, really? Oof. Oh. Yes, cancel save. Yes, cancel save. Shouldn't have to agree three times to cancel a save. Really not that much of a big deal game. Uh, yeah, this bit. This bit's actually quite cool. Uh, is it going to be cool here? <laughs> uh, we'll see. Okay. So, let's have a little look around these pots. Okay. Game is definitely giving us, a, like, a lot of money. Um... I'd rather it didn't, if I'm honest. Like, we don't need money. The game should be giving me more ammo. But the game doesn't really care what I think. That's the problem. The game gives no shits for my whining. Which is fair. You know. A nice big statue of himself. I can understand. Um, right, okay. This is one of the... Ah, oh, yeah. This is one of the weirder parts of the game, I think. Just this, like, giant statue of himself. It's really bizarre. Hmm. Now, if I could only remember... Sure we could... No, ah. Oh, don't hit that. Can we not? Can't go through there. Okay. Ah, that's it. I was waiting for these guys to turn up. And then everything starts moving. Okay. Now, unfortunately, these guys are pretty burly. But we can suplex them again. So, you know, swings and roundabouts. Oh, yeah. The game was not very well designed to fight enemies on a sloped incline either. Now, hopefully they're all going to come to me. The red guy will, but I'm pretty sure he dropped something decent. So, I mean, I guess we can soften him up a little bit. But we don't want to kill him. <sighs> pretty sure he drops like a big pot of gold or something. A nice big load of potatoes. Oh, you dumbass. Seriously? Alright, let's suplex your ass. And you can see how much more health these guys are getting now because the suplex isn't really killing them in one hit. Bioshock is a game that did that. Uh, as you got through the game, the enemies started getting more and more health. You know, that's why you upgrade your weapons, to stay competitive with the enemies. Right, okay. Uh, why are you going down there? Yeah, we're going to have to take these guys out. Oh, that kind of worked. That'll work. That'll work nicely. We shall take what we can get. Come on, you fuck. I don't want to shoot you off the ladder, because that will just be... Painful waiting for you to come up and up and down, up and down, up and down. Yeah, remember when that suplex was a one hit kill? That was pretty solid. Uh oh. Hello. Do you want to be suplexed? You don't want to be suplexed, apparently. You have a tin hat on, sir. That means. Oh, really? What did you drop? Okay, so he that that glitched there, that attack. You can see it kind of went through us, and then we got hit. 
like the whole entire weapon went straight through our body. And then, uh, once he finished his attack, Leon reacted. There's a lot of weird things like that in this version of the game. Apparently. I didn't actually know that, but... Right. Let's go. Oh, God. Alright, now, if we could have this... Uh... Did we, did we go right to the top floor? I can't remember now. No, we haven't been right to the top floor, have we? Jump over. Thank you. Thanks, game. That'll work. Kind of. Just. Okay. Anything good? No. No, of course not. Why would there be anything good? Alright, so we're halfway there to the QTE. Oh, look. He'd, he'd make himself dizzy. Spinny Winnie. Ah, oh, bless him. I suppose everybody's entitled to their fun from time to time, aren't they? <laughs> look at him. He's loving life. I, I don't have the heart to kill him. I mean, we will kill him. So I guess that was a lie. But uh, I forgot what I was talking about. Oh, <laughs> look at him doing his little spinny winnies. Oh, dude, dude, I actually feel a bit bad for you. You're just enjoying yourself. Last bit of fun you're ever going to have in your life, in your pathetic existence. But, hey. Right. Uh, oh, God, the damage we could do to these guys, but we need to save every single bullet. Ah. <sighs> Okay, two of you. That's fine. Fortunately, that probably hasn't worked out too well because we're just putting them behind us. Alright, that'll work. What are you laughing about, dickhead? And that will work. Unfortunately. Ooh. Unfortunately, there's one down here. Oh, dude. I'll teach you to run without doing your shoelaces up. Maybe his mother does them for him. Well, his mother's probably dead, actually. Probably one of the granados that we killed earlier. That's awful, isn't it? Ah. Did I say awful? Oh, shit. This is iffy. Actually, nothing in that water is there. Uh, I did wonder if there's some fishies. No fishies. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Spending too much time arsing around here. Uh, question... Ah, you can. I thought you could shoot that. I was very confuddled there for a second. It doesn't take a lot to confuse me these days. It really doesn't. Have I played Resident Evil 4 before? Maybe. Can't remember. It looks vaguely familiar, but. Ugh, really? Just a load of potatoes. Really don't need the potatoes. I mean, sh shotgun shells are a thing that I don't mind having. But when you have more shotgun shells than handgun ammo, that's bad. Especially considering the shotgun is a pretty awful weapon. Say we don't want to go over there yet, do we? Yeah, we do. Uh, actually, on half an hour here, that might be worth going saving it and calling it a video. Um, oh, right, hang on. Isn't there a. There's a ladder down here, isn't there? 
Yeah, the shotgun is a the base level shotgun is absolutely fucking awful. I mean, it's good at knocking them over, but that's it. What? The, that, what? What? Ah, uh, oi! I saw the red dude. Definitely saw me a red dude. Got, got your money, red dude. All right. Come face me, heathen. Okay, I mean, he, this dude's got the fucking moves. Like Mick Jagger. He's not fucking around. Pretty sure his head pops. Oh, great. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, that's fine. Okay. Wouldn't it be awful if there's like a QTE where you have to run away from this big, giant, running monster? That would suck. Yep, and of course, we pushed a button and did a thing, so enemies... Oh, great. Would have been cool if the uh, prompt actually showed up. Let's use some shotgun shells, because we have so many. Notice there's some very strange things going on with the camera angle as well. That is also a bug with this version of the game. Alright, well that's nice. Okay, we've got some ammo, which is nice. There's still enemies. But where? Ah, oh, they're over the other side, aren't they? They're like stuck over here. There you are. Really? Why? Why did you jump down that hole? Why? You know, everybody gives the AI um, in Resident Evil 5 a hard time. The AI in this game is equally awful. Admittedly, in this game you don't have to rely on it for survival. But it, it has to be said, these guys are really stupid. Which is, you know, fine, because it's easier to fight stupid enemies than it is to fight, you know, smart enemies. But it has to be said, these guys are kind of stupid. Right, dude, are you going to give me anything? Probably not. Let's be honest. Oh, yes, of course. Now it's doing the thing. Where it shuffles the hands around. I don't know why it does that either. There doesn't seem to be any real point in that. Because we don't, we don't need it to do that. Ah, right, anyway. Now, now we've done all that, I'm going to save the game. Because we're out of time. Uh, and when we come back, we're going to run away from this big, ugly fucking thing and potentially destroy the uh, palace or whatever the hell we're in in the process in fact does this place have a name yeah, it was, well it's just called the castle yeah so we're going to do a horrendous amount of damage to this castle now and uh, you know I'm not going to feel guilty about it to be honest you know fuck these guys to be fair Anyway, till next time, guys.